tēnā tātou te whānau, tēnei kuia he kuia kōrero Māori. Nā reira, tuatahi me kōrero Māori au, tuarua, ka kōrero Pākehā au. Kua tāe mai tātou ki te karanga o te mate. Karanga o te roe mata, o te parekawa kawa, ki tēnei te putiputi o te maunga o hikurangi te putiputi o te awa o waiapu, te putiputi o te uri uri a maui tiki tiki a tārana. Te putiputi o toi te ariki, toi te huatahi. Te putiputi o paikia ariki nui. He wahine māre i kura o te maunga o hikurangi me ona whakapapa katoa. He māre i kura o ona mātua tīpunga. He wahine tūpakari i tōna au ora. He wahine awhi i tōna mana wahine I tōna whare tangata. Pērā i ona mātua tīpuna, pērā i a nēni meima, nēni luima, ona kā rangaranga katoa wahine, wahine toa. Wahine pakari, māre i kura. Kua ngoro ki te pā. Nā reira, ka tāe mai tātou katoa, ki te tuku atu i aia i runga i ona whakapapa, kia hoki atu. Kia hina nui i te pō, kia hoki atu, ki tō tātou matu anu i te rangi, kia hoki atu, ki o tātou matu atipuna. Ko rātou kei reira, hei karanga mai aia, ki te hiki aia, ki te pōhiri i aia, kia hoki, ki te pūmoto moto o iu, o tātou matu anu i te rangi. Ā, hākoa o tātou hāhi, ā, hākoa ngā hāhi, ka hoki. He ō ati, he ō ati, tēnā ki te au Māori, me hoki, ā, wairua, engari ōna mahi mahu e mai i aia mo tātou. Nā reira, haere atu e kui, haere atu koe rungi tō rangatiratanga, haere atu koe. We're going through a, a ritual at the moment, and it's just amazing how we were left with a learning like our Māori world, our ethos teaches us and promised us we would all meet again with our tipuna. So we had a responsibility to send her on her way, give her apakura, give her tangi, give her aroha, roimata, to send her on her way. And my respect to all the religions and teachers, um, churches that we belong to, Nanny, this nanny is not here to um, interfere with that. This nanny is talking. Chikanga Māori, tēnā koe e tama kore ronai. And thank you. Ko koe te pau rangatira o te whānau nei, ko koe te pau here, ko rero pau arahi te whānau nei. How beautiful, beautiful. We still have a pau here, like Papa sitting here, to guide us on our journeys. So today we are here at the promise 
of our chipuna. That, that's the difference with our chikunga Māori, ka hoki atu irunga i te karanga, te o ati, the promise of our chipuna that they, they will be there to reach, to lift her, to receive her, to call her back, to call her back and, and to that promised place. And so when we go back to our marae or wherever we make a marae, we have the same call. We can call her spirit back to support us. And so the pitho continues. So the, the awedua continues. It continues to take us back on that journey. We can bring them back when we need help, when we want to heal, when we want to stand tall for whatever purpose that promise is there, but we have to get connected. Ma te chika, ma te pono, me te aroha e. Tēnā tātā. Lola, tōhu wa whao wha mui o tūa. Mui mana tūa koe o whae tō tōmu tāwhi. Ofi a te koe o amana ki anga. Mui ofi a whae nāu te kātū māo. Rofi a te au wha whao mui o hong tau he māmu o nui māmu kāo. Good morning, good fuck on you, go ill on you, go put on you. Amen, Lola. eulogy time, there are three eulogies we're hoping to have. One will be from Nini Mere Phillips. We're hoping she might be arriving anytime soon and we'll welcome her. She's giving her eulogy. Then we have a rangatahi part of the eulogy and Kiwa will talk about the lid, the coffin lid. 
how it got to be beautifully arranged. The whakapapa, yesterday I had a kōrero about, um, I had a muffed kōrero really, it was, it was a muddled kōrero because it was just me. Oh, but I did correct it. I got corrected a few times by Auntie um, Louisa over there. And then, then I finished, but it was Kiwa who raised, Dad, what about us? And so he was quite right. These ones here have only, some of them, have, it's been years, might have been 20 years since I've seen some of them. And I was calling them some of them, some of my grandmothers, and I thought they were still teenagers. But anyway, so that's the importance of the Whakapapa board being up there, is that so, first of all, you can see it, question it, correct it, and then learn from it. Oh, here, here was the ma master correction over here too. Kia tika tika. And then from that, you learn and you, you, you will know where you're from. Where you're from. You will know your whakapapa. You will know the links across the whakapapa lines and you will, you will hopefully contribute to getting it right. There's lots of questions even on that board. What does the X mean? Why, who is in red and who is in blue? And that's, that's, that's a 24 hour work so far, but the implications have, will be mwaketunat, for, will be forever, because you will know. Okay. We need a space filler. My voice is getting tired. Ingari, people have asked, oh, why are we having this whakatau time, mihi mihi time now? Well, it's very simple. We know we had mum in the funeral director's home, and they all go home at five o'clock. And we know we went on a marae and we, we couldn't organise ourselves, ourselves to be in a 24-hour space. Which also meant we didn't have a poor whakangahau or a poor poroaki where we have the night to say our last farewells to mum. We didn't have that. We're having it now. Okay? So, you got something to say? You can say it now. At 11 o'clock is when we change things and we put the lid on and we take the quarter way off and we displace things around and we'll have different, different parts of that. So I really encourage you, don't be shy.
ke a koe te tuatahi e te whaia. Aha ko te kātinga o tō waka. Aha ko e kore koe e taia te kitia a karu. A e kore e mutu i tō kītinga o tō whānau e tangi nei. I mihi tēnei e te tūtai e te whaia mai i te whare karakia o te toko toru tapu i Parawai. Ahakoa e kore e taia e koe te noho i reira tō whakaaro tuatahi. Kei te wai mari e mātou e noho nei koe kei wainga i a mātou i tēnei whare karakia. Kia koutou, e te whānau, ko a hara mai nei, hei kawe mai i te tino nui o ngā pauri, i te tai mahatanga kai rongo i a koutou i tēnei wā. Aha koa te aha, Ka kore e taia e mātou te whakatau i te nā tai mahatanga nā te nui o te aroha o tō tātou whaia e takoto nei. Engari, i rongo a hau ki te tihi kōrero o tō tātou anti a nāna te ki a hākoa te hāhi a hākoa te ahā Kei ko nei mātou e whakanui i ākoe e te whaia. E whakaaro ana ki te karanga ko karanga tia nei i te nei wā. Anō rere ki a tātou katoa, te nā koutou. Ko Brendan P. Peke Wilkins in the hau, nō Ngāti te wehi i kā whia moana tai atu ki Ngāti hako, Ngāti tamatera i pairoa e mihi ana ki a koutou e tangi ana ki tō koutou taha i tēnei wā. My job is simply to acknowledge you, auntie, and you, the family, as you figure out how you are going to do life uh, without her. That's an in, most an impossible question, but that's the question you'll face with today. Uh, shortly we're going to pray and then we're going to sing our first of two hymn there that the family have chosen for us together today. Uh, then we'll hear from various representatives of auntie's life and there'll be a short time for anyone who would like to come uh, before we continue in our service. Kei nui tātou. E te matua i te rangi e te matua o ngā mea katoa aha koa tō karanga ki tō tātou whaia. He nui tonu tēnei mamai o mātou katoa. E whakaaroa noho ki ki a rātou e kore e tāia te hara mai a tinana. E te matua i tēnei wā tonu whakatata mai ki a mātou e tangi nei. Ko mai koa i tō kaha, i tō whakaaro nui o roto i tēnei mate mō mātou katoa. Tēnei mātou e inoi ana e whakapono ana ki tō ingoa tapu i ronga i tō ingoa i inoi ana mātou. Amen. I invite you to join together as we sing our opening himere tamangākau Kiwa, can you play that?
Tuatunai Tuatahi he wā poto ko wai au ke mōhi o mai koutou ko wai tēnei e tū atu nei mui a koutou i runga i te haumārie. Ko mere mata kino uh, Philips ni korohina taku ingoa. Uh, ta māhine a reretima wai te mata paringātai rāua ko mōhi tūrei te okeroa korohina. Nāme mutu nō tēnā taha i nāi nei kua mōhi o koutou ko wai au. Mi mihi atu ki āta, te mininga, kua tai mai i tēnei āta, ke te mihi atu ki tō tātou uh, uh, pāriha kei muri nei nāna nā tā karakia i tuku āroha mai i runga mō mātou katoa. A mihi atu ki āta nei, nāna te rā i whakanui, nāna hoki, uh, nōna hoki, te whāia e takotu nei i mui a tātou. Nā reira tēnā koe ātene. Uh, ko nui rawa aku kōrero ki taku mōhia, engari me mihi atu ki a tātou. Uh, anō nei te mahana, te whaka, whanaunga, te aroha nui, te whānau kotahi, kotai mai, ki te whaka nui, ki te mihi atu, ki tō tātou uh, Marei kura i tēnei ata. Um, nā reira, ko hoki ki te wā, e, e whakanui ai, e ki nei uh, te reo pākehe, he, he eulogy, ke a nei, he whakamihi, he whakanui i tō tātou rā, i wāinganui i a tātou katoa, te whānau i tēnei rā. Nā reira, tēnā tātou. Tēnā tātou, tēnā tātou katoa. Aroha mai kei roto katoa i te reo te nuinga, engari uh, kei te mōhi o au ka mārama mai i a koutou i tēnei rā. Mihi atu ki taku te māhine, nāna i tai mai, mena kāore, ko tai ke au ki ingarangi. <laughs> e nā reira, kia ora, pirihara. Uh, uh, rora. Andrews, Grant, McCallum. Tihei Māori ora. E te taonga a te mate, te mārei kura, te rangatira, te kōkā, te māma, te nēnē kuia, tako tō mai koe i tō moenga roa, Hoki a wairua atu ki tō kaihanga, nāna nei koe i homai, nāna nei hoki i tango. A nei rātō iwi, ko eke mai ki te mihi, ki te tukuroi mata, aroha ko mene atu koe ki tua o te arai. 
no reira erora haere haere irunga iterangi marie fagamaroatsu ya koto kauria atu te moana nui a kiwa i hoe mai ai o tata utifuna ma muri nei koe e korero ma muri nei koe e fakaro ma muri nei koe e fakamau mahara a ketonu o tira inai nei me huri tata u ki te whanau pani te kiri mate ko tātou te rā ātene te pae mate e noho mai rā i raro i te kapua pauri ko uhia nei tātou i te taonga mate o te rā kia mana wanui mā te runga rawa e whakamāma te huarahi tōmua heke iho nei heke iho nei just a special memory reflects back to the 50s when on my way to Hukarere Māori Girls College would stop overnight at Auntie May and Uncle Napier, they call him Broken, Uncle Broken's, Kingsway Boarding House in Gisborne. They had a lovely business running there. And uh, Huerora, their daughter, um, was the hostess with the mostess and she would take care of all and every visitor that came in to the Kingsway boarding house. Then next day, Rora would drive me down to catch the rail car to Napier. I've come towards the end of this um, celebration, uh, Fano, but I'm sure in her spiritual realm, she would be saying, but I should say, uh, Rora cherished her family in a never-ending bond, bond, and her precious spiritual memoir, I believe, would be, so sadly I leave you with such beautiful memories the way that I hope you will all remember me. Nā reire kua mutu no heo a tātou whakanui ki a orora i tēnei rā. He waia ta tāku moana, moana, nā reire, he mihi mai. Kei te mihi atu, kei te mihi mai o hātu, kia tātou, kua tāi mai. Kia ora.
Come <laughs> Um, I'm just going to be talking about some of some of the things that we got up to, uh, not only yesterday but also some of the things that Nana got up to in her past times, um, and also just to enlighten you as to what kind of a nan she was in in my own rambunctious personality way. But uh, for context, um, for those of you that are visiting for the very first time, uh, we had a bit of a powwow about our hakapapa last night. Uh, in regards to just who fits where. Um, personally, it was for me more than anything because um, every time I always meet with all of the Fano that are over here, I, I'm never able to really connect the dots. So uh, to sort of touch, touch base on it, I am in tree number one of the, the three trees, if you will. Um, this is my father. And this is my grandmother. Um, thanks to everyone for coming. Thanks um, for for sharing the space with us. Um, I, I think I'll just uh, oh we'll touch base on that a little bit later. Um, but I thought I'd better um, enlighten you guys as to uh, what's happening with this uh, two papaku right now. Um, you see you see a, a few little messages alongside here. Um, all sorts of different doodles 
if you will. Um, all, do all done by our, our tamariki and um, some, of the, some of the adults got in there as well once they recognised how well they were doing. Initially, I was a bit nervous when we give the kids the, the colouring in pens, um, just in regards because, um, I mean, you know what kids are like, they just go all over the place. But um, the result is actually quite a, quite a, beautiful, a beautiful look. And um, all credit to young Morgan, Callum, Hannah, starting it all for us. And we all sort of ran with it there. Um, and the, the age range of the people that started colouring sort of went from strength to strength. And all of a sudden we, we, we would see people that were komatua that were colouring in this thing. Um, everybody wanted to get on the, on the action, have their own sort of say as to how we can give Nana a really nice send off. So, um, thanks kids, you're the best. Um, along the front here, we have um, three korowai that Nana um, made herself. The, the green one in particular is, is one that my dad uses. Um, there was a there was an interesting side note. Um, it wasn't her favouritist, um, so I, I don't know why she gave that to Dad. <laughs> um, but it's I'm quite chuffed that she got up to that. Uh, I remember it was maybe like a couple of months ago that I went to visit Hangamata for the for the holidays with Danelle, uh, with the intention of visiting Nana. Uh, unfortunately, um, the, the space was in lockdown. Um, was it someone tested positive? Someone, oh yeah, oh, the, it all continues, eh? Um, so unfortunately, I didn't get to see her, but I was able to call her and just tell her that I, I hoped that I could really see her. Um, again, I wasn't able to see her in that last time. But it sort of echoes um, how I've always remembered her. She, she ended more or less how she's always lived, with an attitude, um, with, a, yeah, with, with, with a, quite a bit of spunk. Um, and I mean, it stands to reason that she's impacted a lot of people because she's got a lot of people visiting here today. Um, even people that I've never really met before, even, um, oh, Andrew. Hey, sorry guys, that's my boss. <laughs> I didn't realize you were there. Um, yeah, I do, I do multiple things uh, aside from that. But yeah, that's a, a little bit of a quarter door about her quarter way. It's a really nice stuff. And when I, when I went to visit our old house in Whangamata, I found uh, the setup was still there, almost as if it's sort of like a legacy that will still continue. So I thought that was quite nice. Um, but to touch on this one, um, the, the hakapapa, hakapapa that I drew up last night, we had a, um, a sort of short hakapapa talk about all of the generations above this. Um, and that's a can of worms. Um, but, <laughs> yeah, this for our generation, all of the, the people that are below Rora's children, we don't quite know how to connect the dots completely. That was one of the things that I learnt coming out of it. The easiest example I have is um, Kayla. The easiest example I have is Kayla. Now the last time I saw Kayla I was six. I am 29 now, so there's a lot that can change, one of which includes having five kids <laughs> and, and all of the other in-betweens that happen in regards to that. So this has been really good encouragement for me to get to know all of our whānau, you know, all of the different things that happen between us. Um, because it wasn't until about 12 hours ago that I figured out where the McCallum came from, where the Grant came from. I obviously knew where the Andrews comes from, um, to a degree. 
That's, again, a can of worms. Um, but one of the huge corridor that sort of comes out of that, in my opinion, is it shouldn't just be enough that we call each other cuz. You know what I mean? It shouldn't just be enough that we're, oh, hey, cuz, that's great and all, like, to know that you've got family anywhere and everywhere. Um, but it's not till you come back to any sort of family reunion for any sort of context that you're just like, oh, you come from this person, or the dots connect here. Um, I had a family reunion maybe like 10 years ago um, on, out in Te Araroa, um, and Nana attended that as well. And yeah, there, there was, it's been a while since we, we met them and I'm, I'm expecting there's gonna be a whole new iwi that we go back to and we have to meet all of them. So daunting, but it's, it's really exciting. Um, yeah, there's, there's lots, of, lots of stuff that we've been able to cover in the last 12 hours and it's, it's really encouraging for me to know who fits where and, and where they all are. Um, but aside from that, I've only really got one tale to tell about Rora that's quite unique to me, um, aside from all of the other stories that you've all heard about her, um, was a time, um, I could hurt some feelings right now, um, a time where I was about six years old and um, we were driving around with Nana and she was out on the porch and she was, um, she was smoking and then I opened the door and I walked and she blew, it right, blew the smoke right in my face um, and I can't remember exactly what I said but I remember giving her, I remember giving her a lot of flack for it for blowing it in my face and based on all of the other corridor that everyone else is saying about her, how she was quite snippy and, and really, really sharp of wit, um, I feel like I've the, I'm one of the only people that's been able to clap back at her in, in that aspect. Um, it, was a rare, it was a rare circumstance, but um, I think that's something I'll always hold, you know. Um, I love my nana. I love everything she's done for our whanau. Um, I love what she did with dad. Um, and I love that, you know, despite her, despite her passing, there's, there's still work to be done. There's, the core all for me is about celebrating who she is now, but also about, um, how do we fill the shoes? So that's my encouragement for not only our whanau, but also those who've come from close and far to come and see us. I'm gonna stop talking now, eh? Yeah, I might just um, <laughs> have a bit of a... Oh, 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 oh. 
te goodness I've got a very hard act to follow and I must admit I am very unprepared for this so you'll have to forgive me if I make a few mistakes ko te kairawhiti te rohi ko arawhana rawa ko te araha me taranaki ngā mauna I'm nervous. <laughs> ko Waikahu, Rawa ko Waik. <coughs> Sorry, ko Taran uh, ko Waiawa Te Awa, ko Tainui Te Waka, ko Te Atiawa Te Iwi. Ko Oromo Piko Te Marae. Ko Tūranga Nui a Kiwa Te Moana. My name is Jackie Harris and I am the Secretary for the Whangamata Kaumatua Ropu. And that is where I met Rora. A long time ago. We've had a very close relationship um, <laughs> Hariata's laughing. I've got no one as a sparring partner anymore. <laughs> I'm, afra I'm afraid if I did anything wrong, I was definitely told in no uncertain terms. But uh, we always got on very well, and there were a lot of apologies over the phone, I can tell you. But um, Aurora and I, we've been together oh, must be 10 years at least or more over that. And she was one of the instigators for starting our, our ropu in Bongamata. She, she was originally in the Titemu ropu, so Hariata tells me. My mind's gone a blank. Um, I'm trying to think. I'm usually not lost for words, <laughs> as Hariata will tell you. <laughs> uh, we've been to, uh, Rora and I have been to many functions all across the Rōpū. We've been to Haraki activities, we've hosted Haraki activities at our in Whangamata and she was always a great one for sitting on the raffle table. 
Uh, we will miss her company very dearly. And our opu will never be the same. I had a lot more I could say and it's just gone straight out of my head. Well, I'm so sorry about that, but it'll come back. Um, what else? In fact, I have spoken at a couple of our members who have passed at their funerals, and each time, Laura would say to me afterwards, what did you have to get up for? <laughs> so I made up my mind, I was not going to speak at your funeral order, but I have got the last laugh. <laughs> and I can see her now, I was dead scared she'd be lifting up that lid and saying, Cut it out. <laughs> um, but no, I've had the last word. Moi mai rā. E whaia a tāhua. Open floor time, please. Open floor time, people. Do you have something? Anna. Kia ora Um, Your mum would say, do not give her the mic. Yeah, I'm 
the bill. <laughs> on my dad's side, um, my grandmother's house, at that particular time, um, was in the car. But I stood in the room. My mum and Rora knew about my kids' face like that. She didn't know about this one. So, a few things about Mum and Rora. You can tell she's from the East Coast. She stays in power with us. If you don't like it, huh. <laughs> move on. A lot of people, they respect the Mum and Rora, but they were very scared of it. And, um, I listened to a couple of the words right now, I heard you go, oh my god, she's you know? like, quiet. And I was laughing and she gave me the mic. She used to say an awful Don't give her the mic, she's loud enough without it. So, yeah, um, we've just actually come back from vacation, been with the night. Um, still involved with the staff. It was just a here that got me involved in the executives and, and committees of that section of the school. There was a lot of memories I had with the display of the best memories I had with all of the only one from the dark stuff that had walk out of the club of the They had a dark stuff. Football uh, sports club. You know, and um she was our money back, she was behind the bar, she was true to her word, you were not allowed to go home with your boss. It had to remain in the club. So when it came to me was Yeah. 
to the last and formal part of our time together uh, with you, Auntie. I want to acknowledge uh, you, the family, firstly, for the way that you have cared for Mum, not just in life, but even in death. The way you have kept her company, the way you have honoured her, the way you have celebrated. I invite you to stand together as we now commend Mum to God's keeping and to God's cover. Kia koe e te faia ko ihoa anake e tapuana e chikana e maramana i runga i tēnā whakapono ka chuku atu koe ki tāna whakawā me ana mahi tohu ki tāna murunga hara me tōna aroha ka whakapaingia te atua te matua nāna nei i mea ki a tia ho te māramatanga o te karaiti ki a koe whakangaro i te ao i runga i te aroha o te atua matua nāna nei koe i hanga i runga i ngā mahi tohu a hiu karaiti nāna nei koe i hoko i runga i te mana o te wairua tapu e whakakaha nei i ākoe whakauru atu ki te kāhui o te hunga pono noho mai i runga i te rangemari no reire te whaia ka chukua tō tinana ki a tahuna he one one ki te one one he pū ngārehu ki te pū ngārehu he pū ehu ki te pū ehu me te tino tū manoko atu ki te aranga ake ki te ora tonu. Koi hu kuraiti hoki, tō ariki. Amen. We join together as we sing our closing hymn as the poor bearers prepare to come. A whakaari a mai.